And I think for the last few weeks, everyone has been trying to get their head around how do we respond to this? I've had conversation with guys and they just, we didn't know how to respond. But I think now we're to a point to where we have to give a response. And as men, I think the young people, as we pointed out a moment ago, they're doing a great job of being out there protesting. The women are doing a great job of stepping up and voicing their opinion. But I'm really concerned that we as men have not weighed in as much as we should. Right now is a time where the world just starts to take a look at what black people have been dealing with for over 400 years, what we've been exposed to. And so we've been continuously traumatized over the years. And a continuously traumatized mind is always on high alert and anxious and distrusting and is impacted. So that mind now is suffering for what we call PTSD, which is post-traumatic stress disorder, which is something that we've lived with over the years. So this was just a window into how we feel as black people. I think that uh, we're in a very interesting and precarious position because um, I think that we have been placed in a position where what looks successful for us is all about what's external and all about what you see we own or it looks like we own. It's an image that's been painted. And I think that it's real hard um, for an average African-American man to be seen in public as just a regular guy. You have to be, you know, and, and, and you you probably had this question when someone sees you, if you're dressed nice, they ask you questions like, are you a pastor? You know, are you are you an athlete? If you're over six, six feet tall, um, if you if you have a interesting voice like Chris, I know you've heard this a million times. Are you a singer? Mm -hmm. So we're constantly um, created by bias and that bias has come from images that are seen of us. Where that gets tricky is that when negative images are seen more than positive images, people begin to criminalize the look of African-American men. 